everyone welcome back in today's drawing I'm just going to be showing you how to draw a really pretty dress so I'm starting by drawing the top of my dress and you can think of this as kind of a heart shape and then As we draw this heart shape, I'm also thinking about what the base or the bottom of my skirt is going to look like. And since this is a princess dress, I want it to be very long and flowing and almost bell-shaped. So to get this bell shape, you just draw two curving lines out from either side of the dress. And then I'm going to draw lines up from the bottom of this dress for the material, the way it flows. And I'll draw some lines down from the waistline also. As I draw, I'm thinking about some of the details that I'll add to this dress and the colors. And I know I want my dress to be in the shades of pinks and reds and oranges. Right here I'm just drawing the straps of this dress. And then I'm going to draw a coat hanger or a dress hanger that it's hanging from. I want to lengthen this dress just a little bit, so I'm adding just a little extra length to my dress by recreating the lines at the bottom of the dress. And then I'll just erase these original lines right here. And I'll extend the lines for the pleats or the folds in the gown down to my new hemline. Now we'll put that hanger in. So I'm just drawing a little curved line here and one here. I'm just drawing these curved lines so that they look like a hanger that is holding on to the dress. And then I'll draw a line across the back for the back of the dress. Now I'm looking at my dress and I'm thinking about those details again. So what I'm going to do is to draw in several spirals and these spirals are meant to look like flowers. And then I'll draw in little ovals in between the spirals which will be leaves and my flowers are going to cascade down towards the bottom of this dress and the leaves will follow the flowers so when I'm done drawing this it'll look like a really pretty cascade of flowers and I'll also do the same thing at the bottom of the dress, except that I'll go the opposite direction and I'll draw my spirals and leaves like they're trying to reach up towards the flowers that I'm drawing right now. And I'll put some flowers up along the side of the bodies on this dress to add some interest. And then once I get finished drawing these flowers, I'll go ahead and color them in in really pretty shades of hot pink, red, and green. And the dress will be finished. Hey, that does it for today's drawing lesson. If you have any questions, any comments, or requests for a special drawing, be sure to leave that in the comment section below. Make sure you hit the like button and click to subscribe so that you will receive the 
notices to all of my brand new videos every Monday through Friday. Thanks again, guys. Happy drawing and see you next time.